Hi, I'm John Zarella at the Kennedy Space Center Visitor Complex, and you're going to spend the day with me taking a look at some of the things you just have to see because we're always exploring. You never know who you're going to run into when you come out here to the Kennedy Space Center Visitor Complex. Look, just back from, from Mars, I take it, right? Nice trip, round trip to Mars. Good, good time up there. See, it's great. So when you come here, make sure you look for my buddy here, the space person. One of the most popular spots at the visitor complex is called the Rocket Garden, and that's where I am now. Why is it called the Rocket Garden? Well, everywhere you look, there are rockets. There's a Redstone rocket, there's an Atlas rocket, there's a Saturn 1B rocket, and there are space capsules all over this area. Now, I'm standing in front of a Redstone rocket. The Redstone rocket is the one that lifted astronaut Alan Shepard, the first American in space on his suborbital flight. And just down there to the left, well, that's that Saturn 1B rocket I was talking about. That's the one that was used during the Apollo Soyuz program, the Saturn 1B rocket. And over here on the other side, this is the Atlas rocket. The Atlas rocket was used to launch John Glenn on that first orbital flight, Friendship 7.